third from home, and we'll probably see them in close-up as they come to this particular fence. They're roughly three furlongs from home, and it's still the White Blaze, Tingle Creek, and David Mould who lead from Pendle in second, coming to the third last, and there we are, Tingle Creek, up and over, from Pendle in second, in third place after these, comes Amarin, Dulwich is four, does Balderson definitely right out of the hunt now, coming to the final two fences in this pattern chase, with Tingle Creek rising just first from Pendle, who is closing all the time, it's going to be a real cracking finish between these two because Pendle is fit, he's been out he was out only a week ago, Richard switched him over onto the inside to come to the final fence, and they jump it together Tingle Creek and Pendle, nothing between the two Amarind was over third, Dulwich fourth and now Pendle is showing his class it's Pendle sprinting on and just going clear of Tingle Creek but it's a great race to the post, but Pendle's going to win it at the line, Pendle is the winner Tingle Creek is second, Dulwich in the end just catches Amarind, so it's Dulwich third, Amarin fourth, and these four well fair of Osbaldiston, who bravely took on Tingle Creek in the early stages.